it's Zena, Warthog Princess, and I have lug mail. Yay! But before we open the box, I have one other item that came from QVC, um, and this is the Coop in Bloom Black. I really love this pattern. Um, yeah, so this is, of course, the bubble quilting on the front, which I really, I really think that's pretty cool. And then it's just a regular coupe. I like the interior color as well. It reminds me of like uh, my silky pajamas from Korea way back when. And then it has the nice strap that is removable, of course, and it can be used as a belt strap as well. Inside you have one clear ID window and one privacy pocket. And that's it. It's just a coupe. I love it though. Some people call this their house bag. I don't know if you've heard that or not yet, but um, I haven't really gotten into that yet. I prefer just a pocket for my phone and really I'm not moving around a whole bunch to need a house bag, but let's open the box. All right. Oh, first of all, it's a pretty box. Life is better with lug. Yes, it is. It definitely is, especially in COVID times. Of course, on the inside here, there's more pretty sayings. I think it's really nifty when they have the decorative boxes. Okay. A new adventure awaits. Let us tag along. Okay, well, something's falling out already. Let's see what we got. Okay. Woo! I got my first free mask. Woohoo! Okay, Lug really cares. This one looks like. Oh no. It's either a gray or walnut. It's hard to tell through the plastic. I think it's walnut. Looks like a walnut, especially in that lighting. That's nice. And it's, it's regular mask. It has the adjustable doofers on there. I don't know if this is kid size or adult size. I don't know if it says. I don't see. But it does have directions in case you don't know how to put a mask on. <laughs> Okay, put that aside. Next we got, oh, we got something else. Oh, we got a luggage tag. Hey, that's pretty cool. So my first mask and luggage tag. Hey, oh, plus enjoy $15 off when you spend 75. Hey, cool, coupon code. And a cute little card to put in your scrapbook if you want. But. Cool, this actually has some poofiness to it, like padding on the front, not on the back. And then the back just has your luggage tag. And it is a side entry and a nice elastic. I think, I'm not sure how I'm gonna use this exactly. I think I might actually use it as a luggage tag on my Puddle Jumper Wheelie 2 that I got recently. All right, this feels thick. Must be a lot of cards in here. Let's see. The usual warranty, thank you, masks, yeah. Oh, 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 okay. So I couldn't remember which order this was. Hey, we got the uh, blue and black paper. All right, so this is small items. I do have another order pending because I've been dying for that puddle jumper mini, mini puddle jumper backpack or convertible. Anyway, next order. But this order, we got two of the hearts. I got the black and purple. That's good. Purple's my favorite and black goes with everything. And I got these before the swivel stuff came out and before all the patterns showed up. So I still would have probably gotten both of these, but I probably wouldn't have ordered the other ones I ordered. <laughs> but I do have a bloom black one coming, but anyways. So the black one is an, like a nylon, like a midnight black. And the purple one is like the brushed Concord, so it has a little texture to it. And if you haven't seen these already, they're a really nifty, great size. You can actually fit credit cards in here. So it's cool. Oh, it has some desiccant in there. But the problem is if you open it all the way, the, the 
it goes all the way through. There's a big hole. But if you don't open it all the way, if you just leave just a little bit, you can use it for coins. They won't fall out as long as you don't unzip that whole spot. But it is a cute interior, the little purple flowers. That's fun. So that's good. And then the black one, same construct. Um, oh, and this interior is a paisley. That's interesting. So it's nice. It's lovely. I didn't expect that, though. Yeah, here's another look at the other side, different parts. So that's really cool. And then the other thing about these hearts, if you haven't seen them, is they do have a nice clip on them. So like on the coin pouches, I had to add a carabiner to clip it on the things. This one actually comes with a clip built in. And it's not on the zipper. So there's the clip and then the zipper is separate. So that's good. Okay, next we got two totes. We got crimson large dots and also Aloha Navy. Because um, I already had Wildflower Multi. So now we have a couple more to add to the collection. Yay, my first Crimson Large Dot. Actually, it is really, it just really is fun. I'm not a big red person, but I do love Disney, so it totally fits. And then I love this interior pattern. I have to show this because if you have not seen it or thought about it, I'm quite sure it's intentional, but um, it looks like like Mickey heads. I don't have it all the way out, but it's not, but it kind of looks like it could be. Okay, and then Aloha Navy. Let's open that up too, because why not? Yeah. These are $15, and if you spend 120, you get it for free. So I got one free and one paid in this order. And actually like the tag on this one, it kind of is a little bit more subtle, even though it's gigantic, because it kind of blends with the pattern a little more. And I do like this pattern, even though, you know, like oranges and reds and greens aren't my favorite, but I really like it. I think it's really sharp. And the inside, very orange. So I definitely wouldn't buy anything in that pattern, but I like it on this one. Coordinates really nicely. Okay. And then the main, oh, oh main attraction is the Via 2 convertible in Heather Gray. Now, I ordered this, and no kidding, days later, the mini puddle jumper came out. Funny thing, because I think at first glance, they're basically the, basically the same. Uh, and they're not, I and mean, obviously there are gonna be some differences. I look forward to, oh, that feels heavy. I wonder why that feels so heavy. Hmm. Um, but anyway, I look forward to comparing the two. They're about the same size. They both have the front configuration, like the two small pockets and a big pocket. They both have the backpack straps that are tuck awayable. I think they both have a pocket there. Anyway, um, I know for sure the difference is the Via 2 has the doctor bag opening. So you've got the framed top. Yeah, so aside from that, I am really curious. So we shall see, but let's look through this anyways. We've got the front pocket and this does have a beautiful interior pattern, which you don't see there, but you do on this side. And this side has two pen slots, that's it. So I know that's different. So that pocket is different on the mini pedal jumper. These pocket on pocket are same, same. We've got phone pocket as usual. Nice handles that you can grab, just like the uh, Via 1 actually. And then the crossbody strap does go diagonal, and I think that's just because of the opening. So the front one's here, and the back one's in the opposite corner. Um, because of the framed top, they can't line up straight on the sides. I haven't really used the framed top yet, so we'll see. That does have nice generous cargo pockets on the side, both sides. And this one is not magnetized, that's okay. They are elastic. And then on the back, we have the backpack straps which hook on down here. And these do tuck underneath if you want them to. So they can be a little more discreet. You don't have just loops hanging out. So there you go, they tuck in really nicely. 
the straps are there, and then you have one other pocket. Sorry if I have enough hands here. Right there. <laughs> so, and this pocket is the whole back of the bag, which is nice. And what I like about this is, you know, I've been using the Cancer, and the Cancer pocket there is Velcro. And it turns out I'm not liking that at all. I do like the zipper, I do like magnets. I think really the zipper is the best option there, but there you go. And then it has a trolley sleeve with the Velcro dot, and I don't mind the Velcro there, of course. So, that's the outside. On the inside, we've got a key bungee. That's nice. I think on the mini pedal jumper, it's not a bungee, it's just a little nubby loop. Um, I do prefer this. It's easier because you can just reach in blindly, find that thing, and then find the end and get your keys out. You got your movable, adjustable strap. No pad on there. Then you have a big cargo pocket here, and it is fleece lined, so you can put tech there. Um, I'm not actually curious, because I'm filming on my iPad, but I have the case. So let's see. I think it'll fit. Oh, easily, very nicely fits in there, so that's really cool. That's all on the back. The bottom of the bag, it does have like a flip down bottom on the inside to make it kind of a semi-rigid bottom. It does have feet, but not the plastic wipeable covering. That's okay, but this, I love this heavy material. It's such a neat feel. And then on the front, you've got a double pocket. So one half is plastic, clear plastic right there and then the other side is a privacy pocket it's the same zipper all the way across and then there's a seam down the middle and that's it for that side so two pockets on this side big cargo on the other side and that's it it's actually pretty simple but i think it's just right oops let me put this back in very nice and i'll put this tissue in i guess that protects the plastic okay and then we shall zip it up. I think, I don't, I've always liked these little tabs, so I wonder if I can tuck it in and keep the end inside. It, I might have to safety pin that to tag it, but, because it doesn't really need to go beyond, okay, this is, that's going to, no, no, that's not gonna work. You have to have that to zip that sucker up. Okay, so that's the V2, and there you go. And I do have another order coming with the mini pedal jumpers, and when that gets here, we'll do a side-by-side -side comparison of the two, and maybe even incorporate some Vera backpacks for additional comparison. We'll, we'll see. But that's it for this one. Next up is a Vera haul, and it's a little bit bigger than this, so. All right, thanks for watching. Hope you're doing well. And today is, what, Thursday. Wow, this week flew by. Um, take care. Washi washi. Bye for now.